I was with Toys R Us for about 12 years as a store director. I call myself technically semi-retired, uh, but yeah, this is just something to do. You know, kind of get a little money, get out of the house. Uh, it still gives me you know, the time off to do vacations and trips, things like that. I was looking to make a career change, and my wife played tennis with someone that actually was a bus driver and suggested that to me, talked to her, and decided to give it a try. The Northeast uh, football teams, uh, Northeast basketball, uh, Northside cheerleaders, Northside soccer, and a few others occasionally. But those are the ones I pretty much do all their trips. I enjoy, this, in particular, this, this schedule. Uh, it gives me flexibility. I can do my morning route, go play nine holes of golf, come back, do the afternoon route, and uh, you know, not be crunched for time. So it works out real well. Typically, I'll get up five o'clock in the morning, get up to the bus somewhere between 5.45, six o'clock. My route starts a little bit later than some of the others. And then I'll be done in the mornings between 8.45 and nine. I'll go back to the bus about uh, one o'clock in the afternoon. I say the main thing really is the, the safety. I try to be as quiet as I can and not say as much as I, you know, so when I speak, it's, it's kind of where it's really needed. Well, again, I think it goes back to uh, uh, the service part of it and, and being part of something special, being part in, of a career that matters. We have to have people that can get those kids safely to and from and take care of the kids while they're on the buses. This is a big responsibility. It's not for everybody, but it's for a lot of people and it's for those special people that want to serve. Mm -hmm.